What's up, Hi. you guys? Welcome back to another day. Hi! Another day in the life of Miss D. Um, she clearly wants to say hi. Huh. Oh, don't show him your food. That's not ladylike. Show your food. What? You can show them what you're eating. She's eating some turkey for her lunch. She's eating strawberries, and she's eating some cheese puffs. I tried out this new lip. How? I tried out this new lip, you guys. She's, like, in a stage where she wants me to help her eat the food that she already has been eating. Like, you just want to go back to acting like a baby? I don't understand. Maybe because she's tired. Anyways, I tried out this new lip combo i always use um well i'll say eight times out of ten i'm always using super for my um my lipstick like the crayon case and i think let me not get to lying what the names are but i think it was an orange one i mixed with in a light brown the orange one i know for sure i think is pretty much called pablo i don't know what the light brown neutral one is but i mixed those two together and it looks fuego but anyways, um, we are going to be going to Burlington's today. I'm waiting for her to finish eating her lunch. We're going to Burlington's today. Her feet are growing so fast. We got to get her some new shoes. And it's the perfect time anyways because it's almost getting ready to be springtime. <gasps> it's, about to, it's basically February. And um, yeah, why not start looking for new shoes now? So I'm going to go to Burlington's. I always get the best deals for shoes for her like at Burlington's. If I go to Target at times, it's okay. They don't really have that good of a selection. Um, Children's Place doesn't really have that good of a selection and they're definitely overpriced for how fast like little kids' feet be growing. Oh. So I just feel like Burlington's is the best place. Uh-uh, close your mouth. That's not ladylike to show them your food. Not in your mouth. Oh. Nah. So I'm gonna come back to you guys when we oh. either get in the car or once we get to the store. I'll see you guys in a minute. Oh. Okay, y'all. So we made it to Burlington. Yes. Yeah. This girl, she absolutely loves pajamas. I see. But this isn't even our size or your size. Come on. It is cool. Oh, the penguin. Peep, 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 peep. She loves penguin. Minnie Mouse. Just imagine how much more we're going to see once we get to your section. I feel like I could only come to Burlington on the weekday in the middle of the day or early in the morning because when I tell y'all how crowded it gets, y'all know if y'all go to Burlington how crowded it gets. Okay, y'all, so we just got back to the car. Let me turn this heat down. It's definitely cold outside. Um, baby girl got her some light up shoes. Show them your shoes, Nola. Hey, fresh kicks. So she wears a seven, but I got her a seven and a half because the eight was a little bit too big and she's already a toddler. So I didn't want it to have, be too big that she was tripping on the shoes. And I'm like, you can't go wrong, it was $20. So, um, she got a backpack as well, a Minnie Mouse backpack, and she wanted the Minnie Mouse pajamas as well. Hopefully these fit her. I'm looking at the weight. It says it goes up to 28 pounds, and she's definitely like in the 30s at this point, um, just from her last doctor's appointment, but we shall see. Hopefully it fits her because um, when I got something from 3T here a few weeks ago, and... Um, yeah, when I got something from, that was 3T a few weeks ago, it was a little bit big. The 2T that I got her still fits her, but this is like a sleeper all in hi. one. So we'll have to see hi. exactly how it fits on her. Are you saying hi now? Hi. So we're about to go to Smoothie King. It's 149. Got to, I want to go there before I go to get Marley just to kind of kill more time. So it's not like I have to go inside, come back out with her. Because I know she's already sleepy at this point. She's been up since like 7. So, um... I'm gonna go to Smoothie King and I'll come back to you guys when I have my smoothie. Okay guys, so I got my Smoothie King. I thought I was gonna go inside and have like a quick little vibe session with Nola, but she fell asleep. So I went through the drive through and she's currently sleeping now. I was gonna take her to the park, but she's knocked out. Go ahead, person, just go. She's completely knocked out, so I'm just gonna let her sleep until it's time to get her brother because I don't wanna have to go back and 
inside the house to bring her out if she's already sleeping. So I'm probably just still gonna pull up to this park and just chill there because why not? Yes, surf ski smoothie that I got from Smoothie King. I I'll usually always get like a strawberry banana smoothie, which essentially I kind of did, and then they ordered. I added the um the vegan plant-based protein to it because I'm like I wanted to have protein. I know like after I worked out, I had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich just to give me those that that little bit of protein. But uh, -uh your girl wanted mo. But yeah, I'm a New Orleans girl for life, y'all. Always gonna find my way to a Smoothie King. Always. People always be like, oh, why you wanna go to Smoothie King? Because I'm from New Orleans and that's what we do. Smoothie King for smoothies and juices, okay? Now, don't get it wrong now. You could definitely have um, different, ugh, definitely have different kind of juices that's from like other places, but my preference, my preference, baby, is always some movie king. Okay, I'm just so ready to move to another state and like have it be like a state where it's like warm. I'm thinking of like Houston, Texas, something along those lines where I know it won't be like hard to be outside all the time. All the time. I just parked with my left hand, so it's completely crooked. But you know what? It is what it is because I'm not even getting out. So uh, it's now basically 2:30. I'm just gonna chill for like 20 minutes and then go get my sign. And that's that. Period. Um. You wanna say hi? Hi, hi, mommy. Hey, hi. Hey, y'all. So we currently are chilling at home. Nola clearly just pulled out the camera herself. I thought she was actually recording for a second, but she wasn't. But I pressed the record, but I took that as a sign saying I need to actually start recording again. Uh, we're just pretty much chilling right now. It's almost dinner time. Just relaxing. Marley is in his room doing some reading. Mommy, mommy, you just had a snack. You just had cheese puffs. They're all over your mouth. This girl, she wants a snack like every 20 minutes. Are you hungry? You hungry? No, I'm going to hold it. Whatever that means. Oh, my gosh. She loves Amelia Bedelia books. I used to love Amelia Bedelia books, too, when I was younger. But my brother got her this for Christmas. I think it was Christmas. No, it was for her birthday. For her birthday. She has been going crazy with these Amelia books. She wants everybody to read them to her. And they're not short books. They're like 60 pages long. So, I've been doing a lot of reading, y'all. Oh, her hair is getting so long. I trimmed it a little bit, y'all. It feels so much better. Like, her ends just needed, like, a little light dusting. Just to take off like the little raggedy ones that kept on getting tangled together. When I tell you her hair is soft as cotton, it is so soft. I washed it on Sunday. Today is Tuesday. And it's still like super duper soft. Even the top part being out. Because you know sometimes when your ends are raggedy and they need to get cut, it's hard to actually um, fully moisturize your hair. It feels like it's not really as moisturized. But... Her hair definitely still feels nice and moisturized. I also deep conditioned it too. Hi, yes. You like your hair, Nola? <laughs> I can't wait for it to be summertime so I can just like have her start wearing her hair out. She got a lot of hair, y'all. Yo, I don't know what it was. Okay, I know what it was. I don't know what it was. Okay?